everyone. This is Bridget. Bridge, this is Hugo and Jane, and Hello. obviously you know Cosmo and Woni. Hi, Bridge. This is Alistair and Henrietta. Hello. Julia and Michael. Hey. Joanne and Paul. Hello. And Jeremy's partners from Chambers. This is Natasha Glenville and Mark Darcy. Hi there. Hello. Not in your bunny girl outfit today? No. Uh, we bunnies only wear our tails on very special occasions. Right, B, sit yourself down. Right. Hey, Bridge. How's your love life? Oh. <laughs> Still going out without publishing, Charlie? Uh, no, no. Right. Never dip your nib in the office ink. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> you really ought to hurry up and get sprogged up, you know, old girl. Times are running out. Tick tock. Yes, yes. Uh, tell me, is it one in four marriages that end in divorce now, or one in three? One in three. Seriously, though, office is full of single girls in their 30s. Fine physical specimens, but they just can't seem to hold down a chap. Yes, why is it there are so many unmarried women in their 30s these days, Bridget? <laughs> well, I don't know. <laughs> Suppose it doesn't help that underneath our clothes, our entire bodies are covered in scales. <laughs> I very much enjoyed your Lewisham fire report, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, well... So. It didn't work out with Daniel Cleaver? No, it didn't. I'm delighted to hear it. Look, are you and Cosmo in this together? I mean, you seem to go out of your way to try to make me feel like a complete idiot every time I see you. And you really needn't bother. I already feel like an idiot most of the time anyway. With or without a fireman's pole. That'll be my taxi. Good night. Look, um, I'm sorry if I've been... What? I don't think you're an idiot at all. I mean, there are elements of the ridiculous about you. Your mother's pretty interesting. And, and you really are an appallingly bad public speaker. And um, you tend to let whatever's in your head come out of your mouth without much consideration of the consequences. I realized that when I met you at the turkey curry buffet that I was unforgivably rude and wearing a reindeer jumper that my mother had given me the day before. But the thing is, um, what I'm trying to say, very inarticulately, is that, um, in fact, perhaps despite appearances, I like you very much. Uh, apart from the smoking and the drinking and the vulgar mother and the verbal diarrhea. No, I like you very much, just as you are. Mark, we really are making progress on the case in here. Jeremy's had the most brilliant idea. Right. Right. I must go. Uh, because... Well... Bye. Someone exactly like you I've been traveling all around the world Just as you are. Well, oh, not thinner, not cleverer, not with slightly bigger breasts and slightly smaller nose. Oh. Fuck me. But this is someone you hate, right? Mm. Mm. Yes, yes, I hate him. 